There's Mike catching up with him. Walking on the Wachita Trail. Right around Lake Maumel. It's Lake Maumel, right? Yeah. All right. Hopefully we get to see some snow tomorrow. Doesn't look like it today. But maybe. We'll get lucky. Eight inches. So Zach over there tell me about the boar beetles. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Make a oh. nice little cut. Awesome man. Awesome. Anyway, here we're out here at the uh, Wachita Trail on Lake Maumel on the back side. Had another guy with us. I think we lost him. Hate it for him. Anyway, we're uh found us a little spot out in the middle of nowhere. Got my pack, it's about 31 pounds total water, food, everything, stove. Got my stove on there all ready to go. It's not supposed to get cold tonight. And they're expecting uh, some snow tomorrow sometime, about six to eight inches, they say. So we're gonna have a blast. So anyway, we're back out here, just got our camp set all up. And take a look at the lake over here. Sunsets going down. Zach's over here got his stuff all set up. Little tarp I made for him a few days ago. Uh, Zach, what's going on, man? Just sticking my belt, getting it adjusted just a little bit. I couldn't do it with the back, with the uh, bag full. Awesome, man. Get it squared back up. All right. That's one of the big expensive seats right there. I think he got that at Walmart. <laughs> well, here's my smokehouse shelter. My stove. Fix and put that thing together, fire it up. We're gonna be cooking. Awesome, man. This is it. All right, we're gonna watch Smokehouse put together his smokehouse. Stove, man, stove. Stove. Already had the stove together. So we're gonna get the legs off. We'll saw. Put that right there for now. See what we need to do is put these legs on. Back these off a little bit. Hold that here a little bit so I don't have to worry about putting this thing together. Slide zone. I think there's Zach. I think that's pretty handy dandy. Stove looking good. 
pipe. I had to build these little covers because when I had a little house fire, burn all my stuff up. So I had to build some more stuff. So the pipe comes in like this. This one's seven foot long, 12 inches wide. It's just a little thin sheet. And I've burned it several times, so it's going to take its form. And you just kind of roll it out. Pops into place. Let's see. Got some rings, goes around it. A little damper here. A ring for the other end. Have a spark arrestor right there. And six little rings to put this pipe together. Normally, what I do is I go ahead and slide all the rings on, I just overlap it. Back them all on at once. Just kind of space them out through here. And it doesn't really matter which end. I'll throw the uh, spark arrestor in next. This will be at the bottom. Let's see. Slide that in a little ways. Make sure I put the damper in right. Go that way. Uh, so I'll put that in right here. Slides in like that. Damper. Good to go. And then I'll move this ring back down a little bit. Not like that. It's good to go. And just so the pipe to keep it form. Huh. Throw that in. That's on the top? That's on the top. Slide this up here. It's a little ring up here. So tighten it up. Kind of spread these out as needed. And then when you slide that to the tent, this you slide right in here. And it's good to go. So I got to clear some of these leaves out. Gonna clear some leaves out, we'll get back. Put the stove in. Slide it through the stove back. One these days. Still the right way. You gotta be kidding me, man. You got music. That's it. It's party. Where's where's your disco ball? That's it, man. That's it. All right. So now all we gotta do is fire it up, which will take but a few minutes. All right. Okay, you just fired up a cotton ball that has Vaseline all over it. Going to. Uh, Light this bad boy up. Got a bunch of little twigs and stuff in there. Breaking up some twigs. By the way, we're out here hammock camping on the Washita Trail in Arkansas. Thank you to this camera.
steel. Sun's starting to go down. You can see the lake out there. Got my hammock on right here. <clears throat> this thing will fire up quick too, man. Jack's over there cutting some wood. <clears throat> Zach needs some big pieces too, man. I've gotten some big ones. Awesome. Stow pipe going out the jack. Almost fired up. It's about the mid-30s out here right now. It's supposed to get down to, I think, around 20 or so tonight. <clears throat> Fixing to... Uh, Cook a little bit of dinner. Zach, what are you cooking for us tonight? Uh, a little tortellini and a little uh, red sauce and meatballs. Awesome, man. And then I'm going to do a little uh, skillet peach crumble for you. <laughs> Zach is our cook tonight. That'll be the fire. I'm going to cook right here on the stove. That's what my chair is for. Close this down a little bit. Got the damper open a little bit. Get it getting hot. Oh yeah. Heat's coming out, feeling good. Let's go here and take a look and see what we got. Well, it ain't smoking yet, but it's fixing to. Oh yeah, big temperature change already. Matter of fact, I think I'll turn this damper down a little bit. You got some smoke coming. Yeah, I turned the damper down a little bit. It was getting a bit too much. All right, we'll be back. 